what's up guys it's your boy bugs on dj and what you're watching right now is some mw3 gameplay on kill confirm on this map i do not know and my boy right here rare vivers pulls a moab on these noobs these scrubby people they're not ready for him he is a beast he also he's also a member of ink you know inck you don't know that da, da, the link will be in the description i guess yada yada but yeah he is a proud member of them and he's actually on his mw3 account which is deadly virus that's why his name is you know actually different and this ain't no oh acr uh yeah a arc or acr or p90 moab this is using the ump i don't know i i ump 45 with rapid fire and he picks up random weapons at the um throughout the video like he picks up other weapons and he's using the p9 the mp9 Sorry, you know, I'm not a big M33 fan. That's gonna get us into our topic today, guys. Now, what I'm gonna be talking about is I was never a big fan of Infinity War games, and yeah, I just never bought any other games until Ghost came out because it was the next COD, and I didn't feel like staying on Black Ops 2, shitty connection, and terrible hit detection. But yeah, I have six or seven reasons why I don't like Infinity War games. First reason is their graphics. To me, my opinion, their graphics are shitty. They're, it's horrible. Like, I don't like it at all. Like, they're really, really, really bad to me. Like, when I first saw it, I believe MW3, my friend was like, oh, you should buy it. Do it looks cool and stuff. I was like, eh, it don't look good to me. Even though MW3 was in green and I love green. Like, oh my god, I love green. But <laughs> yeah, I just wasn't a big fan of it. And then when he got it, um, I played it and I was like, yo, this game is shitty, like, I don't like the graphics at all, they're really bad, like, the grenades and tactical stuff, like, the concussion and stuff, they're like, colored paper, like, what the hell, like, the grenades, the, it was like a circle lime green and then like a brown triangle, not triangle, I don't know my shapes, what the hell, a rectangular shape on top of it, it looked mad fuji, like, it didn't look good to me at all, that's one reason why I never liked the Fendi World game, terrible, I didn't like the graphics. Second reason, their guns are overpowered. Well, I like maybe like I didn't play the games, but I did watch some of the videos like from other people, and that's why I didn't buy the game. It's because of these videos. It's because like like they get moabs and stuff, but like the weapons are overpowered. Like I, if I like I'm a little kid, I'm gonna be like a little squeaker raging on the mic and stuff because like what I was like I believe eight or nine once MW no yeah no not MW two I was like eleven. Or 12 when um, MW3 came out, and like, yeah, I just the, the weapons are overpowered. Like, the freaking ACR and P90 is like the number one weapons in this game. And I know Black Ops 2 had the overpowered, the, like the AN and, P, and, and PDW, but they have weapons to back up to it. Like, for SMG, the S. The MSMC matched up to the PDW and the Scar H kind of matched up to the AN, but like in MW3, the ACR and the P90 like demolish these games. And then top it off, these weapons have no recoil. You could put whatever you want on these weapons and you could dominate. Like these weapons are demolishing. And not only that, um, the specialist perk, like oh my god, like I'm not gonna complain about it. That's pretty cool. You know, you could have all the perks because you kind of do deserve it, but. I think 7 kills does not make you deserve every damn perk in the game, but I never complained about that. I think it was kind of cool that you got all the perks. Pretty much, that was a little overpowered. You pretty much always indestructible, but I nah, can't really complain about that one. I just hated the gun recoil. Like, these guns never had a recoil, any of them, except like the machine, like the pistol machine guns. That's the only thing that had it. Thirdly, what I hate about it was the maps. Like, how the layout was. Like, they're like dead like I don't know like Black Ops 2 I like the color like I like the colorful maps like I'm not saying that I like my shooting games to be colorful and everything and like being bright and shiny and then you know you see blood everywhere and like dead bodies everywhere but it was just like dead like they were, like it was like so dark and gloomy and stuff like you really couldn't see nothing you could hide, dead hide in the corner or you could hide in these bushes or anything like mad easily the maps and that wasn't that big, but same time they were. So I didn't really complain about the map size until we got to Ghost. Like, oh my God, these, like these maps are like so big for no reason. Especially when we was on the PS3 and like through Xbox 360, when we was only having a 6v6, we couldn't even play Ground War. That was terrible. Having these maps that are like five miles apart and like only have six people, and we're like searching for people, and we cannot find no one. It's just ridiculous. 
how they will even do that. And then to get the smaller maps, you would have to play. I mean, you would have to buy the DLC maps. Like that's no problem to me. I, uh, you know, I get um, I always buy the season pass on my buy a card. But like to have to actually wait for the maps to actually come out to actually play it, that's a problem. Now if we got the season pass and you just gave us all the DLCs right away, all right, wouldn't have no problem. But for all, like you have to wait like a couple of months just to play these smaller maps is ridiculous. And then some of these smaller maps have like stupid layouts, like really dumb layouts. I don't really like the flow of it at all. But yeah, number three is. Infinity War, Infinity War lies. They lie a lot. They they really do. Like, like not really like now. Like before, I don't know if they lie because, like I said, I never really bought any games. I know what they promise anything, but dedicated servers and ghosts. That's 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 like the second top reason why I don't like um, Infinity War. They like they dead ass lie. Like dedicated servers. Where is it? You promise, not even like you said, you promise in the middle of the game coming out. You promise a couple of months before the game even came out. And you said we're all going to get dedicated servers. We playing on the game. There's no dedicated servers. We still got hosts. Like, there's going to be hosts, but like, there's like no dedicated servers. And then, right there, he gets the Moab, guys. But yeah, I'm going to um, finish this topic off later, guys. That's pretty much for the gameplay. So leave a like if you like the video, guys. Comment about anything, you know. I love your comments. Subscribe for more awesome videos and more awesome commentaries. I will finish this topic off in another gameplay, but yeah, I'm Bugs on DJ, and I'm out, guys. Peace.